Well, as we just showed you, a portion of Highway 178 is closed after a landslide causes that major damage. WCBI's Allie Martin has more on how this landslide uh, could impact businesses. This westbound lane of Highway 178 near Moorville shows the aftermath of the landslide. Huge cracks in the asphalt and massive dips in the road. This one is a substantial slide that will take more more work. Matt Dunn is MDOT's assistant district engineer over maintenance. He was called out to this section of 178 Sunday after a motorist said the road looked broken. Dunn and his team discovered the landslide on a steep slope just north of the highway. The decision was made to close a portion of the road. We have the road blocked uh, on our traffic alerts from um, Highway 371 to Treetop Lane. Um, but basically the, the road that's actually closed is right here at the slide. Pressure from the ground saturated from heavy rains could have caused the soil to wash out from under the asphalt and that likely put enough pressure on a 36 inch water line causing a leak in the pipe that serves Tupelo. <laughs> Crews from the Northeast Mississippi Regional Water Supply District were on scene for that repair. This type pipe has a real good service life and been utilized places. In some cases, 100 years is not uncommon. Uh, there's no break in the pipe. Uh, this just appears when whatever causes this ground to move a little bit, uh, pulled a section of pipe loose from the other pipe it was stuck into. Although it's a relatively small portion of 178 that shut down, it does impact traffic and possibly local businesses. That's why the workers at Tin Top Grill hope repairs are made as quickly as possible. It's been a little slower today, but not bad. There's still several ways to get here from Tupelo. The water line was repaired by the end of the day. It will take longer for MDOT engineers to determine how best to fix the damaged roadway. In Lee County, I'm Allie Martin, WCBI News. Now, only four homes are impacted by this landslide. Alternate routes for drivers include Old 178 and Interstate 22.